So I leave for Amsterdam tomorrow, which means there is no procrastinating on the packing anymore. It is something that absolutely needs to get done. And I have been procrastinating just for a moment. Look at, look at our house. My boyfriend's starting a podcast. I thought I heard him. My boyfriend's starting a podcast. And so the equipment in our house just keeps growing and growing. And it's pretty good. So look at that. Boom. And like more cameras and then camera stuff. It feels like maybe it's a little chaotic right now. It might be a little chaotic. Okay, no more procrastinating, let's do this. Slept a whole, slept a whole three hours on the flight, and now we're going straight to work because it's one o'clock in Amsterdam. It's not too cold, so that's good for me. But I do feel like I'm in physical pain from not sleeping. these really cool coffee machines at the venue which I am drinking because I love coffee drama. This is just a look, truly. The hard hat and everything. Love it.
So I actually got here yesterday and basically went straight into work. So I had no time to do anything and then I left my camera at the convention center. So we're vlogging now <laughs> and it's six o'clock and it's, it's evening now. So it's been a whole day too, which there's just, you know, this is the nature of work travel. Something that I always do for work trips is unpack my stuff because I'm here for nine days. So anywhere that I am for a week or more, it's worth unpacking. So, so this is what we're working with. I've already had to take some stuff out, <laughs> obviously, because I'm living. But we're gonna put everything away now because that's just what we need to do. I try to keep my room as like clean as possible because it's home for the next you know few days so and then I also try to make things as easily accessible as possible because I'm usually like in and out of the rooms for quick so when you walk in I keep my backpack by the door because I always need it when I leave this is going to go in the safe, but let's just have a moment for my Louis Vuitton bag. Um, and then bed needs to be made, ignore it. But so then I keep my shoes that are like somewhere easy to grab. And then I keep all my winter accessories that are somewhere easy to grab too. Just because again, it's like I'm con like I'm just in, out, in, out. And I always forget these kind of things. And you definitely don't want to forget your hats and your scarves and whatever. Um, this is just work stuff that I have to take tomorrow. So anything that's like important and just keep front, like out and keep it, um, like easily in my, I keep anything that I need to bring to work like the next day urgently in my line of sight. And then here I have some sweatshirts and oversized shirts, um, and then I tried to use the drawers because, again, I don't like things out for the most part unless they just make sense like that. That makes sense. Um, so underwear is in here. And then I have a couple sweaters that I'm keeping in here. And then all of my pants are down here. Um, bags are here. Sunglasses. And then the closet situation. It's kind of a small closet, but everything in Europe is small. So all my jackets and then pajamas, all my thermals and undershirts, and then shirts. And that's kind of like the quick setup. Okay, so that's my room setup. I'm starting to look tired. It's like kicking it. It's kicking in that I have just like not really slept in days. Okay, so today is the last day before the show starts. So we have to finish setup. I don't sleep here at all like at all so I'm about to get dressed to walk over to the convention center and here's what outside looks like gray but <laughs> almost anything shit so yeah so I'm gonna get dressed and then we will we'll get going This is the last day of setup before the show starts, so still a lot to do. I'm actually feeling pretty good about it being an absolutely disgusting day outside. It's more motivation 
to work where it just doesn't feel as bad that I'm working all day today. So I was editing and I realized that I never explained what my job is. <laughs> so I thought I'd do a little just insert here. And I'm in Amsterdam at this point for the Cisco store, which is a program that I oversee. It is the employee merchandise store for Cisco, but we also deploy Cisco and partner technology in our stores. And then at shows like this, we take attendees through a store tour and show them how we've deployed Cisco and partner technology in a real environment so that they can get inspired to do the same. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's get back to the vlog. Those are fun. What are those? Never seen those before. You're up. So this is the first day of the show. Look at the boots. Right. This is the first day of the show. So we're going to get going. I have six tours today. So I'll show you what that looks like. And um, yeah, nice and pitch black outside. It's 7.50 in the morning and there's no daylight. <laughs> to record content during this event so far because I wake up at 6 30 6 45 go downstairs go to the venue work all day finish at like 6 6 30 and then come back to the hotel pop up to my room and then go back downstairs to go to dinner and then when we're done with dinner I come back up call my family and then go to bed so it's like really exciting stuff but um I'll try to get some more things uh but yeah it's a glam life doing the works the work travel stuff <laughs> okay so the show this is an april spritz from literally five days ago that the cleaning housekeeping won't clean out for some reason Okay, so the show is finally over and I am officially dead. Just kidding, I'm alive. But I have definitely not caught up on sleep and we leave tomorrow or most of us leave tomorrow and we're trying to take advantage of today by getting out in the town. And I had all these cute outfits planned and as I'm getting dressed and looking outside like kind of wet I'm literally just gonna wear thermals and leggings and sneakers so let that be a lesson to my future self cute outfits are good in theory but not great in actuality I literally had so many outfits planned and we are wearing thermals all black dressed in Robber chic. There we go. This is the bottom half looks kind of questionable, but it's okay.
literally the most exhausting 10 days that I just had. I definitely didn't film as much content as I wanted, but we'll take a look at it on the way back home. But here we go. Goodbye to my hotel room. And goodbye to my amazing view. Just kidding. Let's go back home to sunny California.